Day. Right, guys, we're going to start this video here. We're in this empty shell, uh, which is the bar next to Lupa, which this is planned to be called Zombies. A few of you have been asking me, so I thought I'd give you a slight update. If you look around, as you can see, most of the work, all the heavy work has been done. Uh, walls have been knocked out, uh, ceiling, all the frame, frame is up, um, everything is ready there. This area over here, this is a seating, a couch area. Uh, this is how we build the couches. Uh, they come along to upholster them. I think I've explained that to you before. And in the middle here will be a stage, a staging area. And there'll probably be two poles there, two silver poles, and there's a reason for that. Um, in the ceiling, the ceiling will be quite high here, but it'll, be, it'll have either LEDs or TV screens in there. So it's above the stage area and the poles. Which are, the idea is to try and make this look a bit more, a bit cyberpunk, a bit futuristic. Uh, that is the plan here. This is the bar area. Uh, the bar area has gone in. The frames are in for the surfaces. It is quite a big bar area. We have made this one slightly a bit different. So, the colours are going to be different than the others. And this, this is all about, also as well as the, the movie. So that's why we want to make it look a bit futuristic. It's slightly smaller than Lupa. Lupa's quite a big bar, but this is slightly smaller. I think this is probably going to be about 80, 80 seater. Still big though. Still very big. I think like between all the five bars, once this, this is number five, there'll be like 500 seater uh, or 450, 500 seater between them all. So it's quite a, quite a big capacity. This is the front end. These shutter doors here are going to have to be renewed where we managed to get away with the other one. You know, once we, we knock the walls back, we find the old shutters. So we just haven't uh, refurbished to save money. But I think with these ones, they're going to have to be changed because on this one, we're going to have to put a door in here. Um, so staff can get in access to the two bars because we do have accommodation upstairs and we plan to put um, a lot of the staff in the accommodation upstairs. Um, it's all takes time. It's all a work in progress. But the good news is now, well, the bad news first, I missed the deadline. Um, and what I mean by that is the builders um, were meant to start earlier. Um, I, I missed them. I said, just hang on a bit. Uh, and it's, I was planning to get it open for Halloween, but that's not going to happen, I'll be honest with you. But they are booked in to come back and start work on the 24th, which is a week on Monday. So it should take two and a half to three weeks to do it. So I'm looking about mid-November uh, when Zombies is open. Right, there's your update. On to the next place. Next place. Robin Hood Tavern. We haven't been here for a while. We haven't done a vlog for a while. And the other day in the last video, I did say that it has, they've refurbished it. It's not been a complete refurbish. They've had a, a makeover of it. It looks good inside. So what we're going to do is we're going to go in, we're going to get some lunch. And more importantly, we're going to meet somebody very special here. Uh, he's a vlogger. And I'm not sure, I'm pretty sure a lot of you won't know him because he's sort of quite a new vlogger, but he's exploded. He's really taken off. And he's been in South America, uh, Colombia and Brazil and now he's arrived in Pattaya. And tomorrow, which will be yesterday, when the video goes up, he'll, he'll upload his first uh, Pattaya video. This is a real character. Let's go and meet him. Here we go. Guys, meet Roberto. Nice to meet you guys, nice to meet you. already saw my new girlfriend, eh? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Roberto meets the, Roberto V the world, should I say. Roberto, welcome to Pattaya. Thank you, my friend, thank you. And um, you've been here before, Pattaya? Yeah, bro, of course. Tell, tell everybody a little bit about yourself, what you've been doing. Um, uh, you, I mean, basically, you only set up YouTube about eight months ago or something like that? Uh, yeah, uh, which month is it now? Yeah, no worries. Yeah. Okay. Uh, which month is it now? Okay. <laughs> now it is... October. October, October, yeah. <laughs> uh, October, so I started like uh, around December, late December. I, I switched from uh, Swedish to English, but I did not have anything on Swedish. Like, I did not have many views on oh, right, the... right. So, so when you first started, you, it was in Swedish language? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But uh, that was like uh, three years ago. Right. Then uh, I switched to English like in, in, in December, January this year. Yeah. And then it took off. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So where have you been then? Where have you been going? Wow, uh, in Thailand I have been everywhere, but not, only like the crazy place, you know, like uh, Bangkok, <laughs> uh, Pattaya, 
I've been Kupang Gang, and I have been in Phuket. But uh, Pattaya is obviously the favorite. Do, do, do you prefer Pattaya area? Yeah, I, I, I prefer Pattaya area because, not only because the girls, you know, because the girls you have everywhere. And I've also been in many other mm -hmm. places in the world, South America as well. But I like Pattaya because mostly of the Falang here, they are so, they are like you, bro. Thank you. Bro, Thank you. you. You have a camera, like, bro, you, you, you obviously have an audience, you obviously are a cool dude. And, Oh, every, way, every time here is so cool because I'm fucked up, but you always, always also meet one guy that is more fucked up, well, you know, you... <laughs> <laughs> well, I like, well, this is what I like about it tonight. Um, you, guys, if you haven't watched him, watch his videos. I was been, I've been binge watching him this week and I've been... Um, I, it's just hilarious. And your videos go on for quite a long time, like 30 minutes, 40 minutes, but you can watch him because he's just hilarious. Tell us about your time in, um, I think, the last place you were in Colombia. Uh, I was in, uh, yeah, Colombia, Brazil and Mexico. I see, dude, I've seen some... Crazy parties you've been yeah, doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But but you know, in 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 in, in Thailand, <coughs> you know, you don't need so much. You know, in, in Colombia, it can go wild, really more wild. You know, the the the, the women are, 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 are obviously much more hot than here. But also, it comes danger with this. You know, yeah. it's a little bit dangerous. It's not safe as this. And sometimes, you know, when life gives you the hand, take the little finger. You don't have to take all the hand. But I'm happy I was there. I will go back to, to Colombia, but my all-time favorite is Brazil. Yeah, oh, right, right, in the, right. In, in the favelas. Why, why is that? Because... That's why you had all that party, wasn't it? You, you had the, the, the crazy party. Yeah, crazy parties everywhere, but, but one of the most crazy parties I hosted was in, in the favela of Brazil. That's what the one I'm talking about. Yeah, it was like, bro, everybody's talking about, like, uh, Matrix, you know? This is not in, this is out. Like, when you go inside the favela, it's machine guns, like criminals, like bandits, you know? And I love it because it's so safe. Really, it's safe. It's so because I myself is from a like, like neighborhood in Sweden that a lot of criminals. And I grew up with, with like, safety. We, we, we know the streets. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. in the favela, they know it. Everybody nobody knows each other. Nobody wants to rob you. Nobody wants to take advantage of you. And I, obviously, I spend a lot of money here, but they like me and I, and I like them. And, and the girls don't ask for money. And the girls. They don't ask for money? No. They don't ask for money. It's not like Colombia and Thailand. Colombia and Thailand is same same. You know, yeah, yeah. every girl want money. Mm. You know, and, and in Brazil, no. They they they, they like when you are like a strong man. You know, like like when you how can I? I don't know how to explain. Like they they, they like when 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 you are like they're forward. Like a, yeah, they're like an alpha male. Yeah, alpha male. Exactly. That, not, not a better male. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> and then. A lot of better males here in, in Thailand, but, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and you have also the girls for the better males, you know? Would, would you consider yourself to be, this is the way I look at you, a global monger? Global mongo? Monger, monger. Monger? What means with monger? Do, do you know, not, not know the term monger? No. Okay. Basically, he's a guy who plays. You know, he plays, um, he's not interested in settling down, he just wants to play and yeah, party. Yeah, 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 100%, 100%, yeah. 100%, 100%, yeah. I, I'm a global monger, yeah. <laughs> I'm a global monger. Yeah, yeah, good word. So, so what, what's your plans for Thailand then? Oh, pa Pattaya. Are you staying in Pattaya or? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. At the moment I'm staying in Pattaya and uh, like, uh, as I was saying, I, I was here, everything went super well and I was traveling in around and now I come back. So my first video drops tomorrow. Bro, it, it, it's next level shit. Where, where, where did you make the video? I made it in Phuket. Okay, okay. But yeah. I'm literally like on a like luxurious boat with the five hottest ladyboy of Thailand. Oh, okay. And it went wild, my friend, you know. Do you like ladyboys? I don't like... I, I cannot say I, I cannot say I don't like them, you know, because yeah, obviously, I, I'm honest, they're hot, you know. Mm -hmm. In Thailand, like, the, the hottest one are ladyboys, you know, and, and they are hot, bro. Well, what can I say, you know? It's, it's, not, it's not like I go to bed with them. <laughs> but, I, you know, like the first time I, time I came here, a seed like was like ah lady boys then ah lady boys ah it's okay you know yeah 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 and I don't know I, I mean it's okay like you can stay around them you know first yeah. I was afraid but then I was like bro I was just thinking what you, you were on a on a yacht yeah. you were in this nice posh yacht probably expensive to buy and you were five lady boys and you didn't do nothing bro you will see in the video <laughs> obviously I, I did something you know maybe I did not I, maybe I did not score a goal you know but I, I I had some interactions like corner kicks free kicks you know but, but they, no goal. But I, I, it was wild, you know. This, this is what I like about his videos. He, 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 if he gets blown out, he'll be like a, a penalty miss. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's all about scoring goals, you know. And I don't know, like in Thailand, obviously, lady boys is a thing, you know. And I don't know, like. I, how, how long are you going to be staying in, in Pattaya for? I, I cannot answer this question. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. I, I think I will stay here for a while because 
I like it here, you know. I, I'm relaxed here, you know. Mm -hmm. yeah, Even yeah. if it's so crazy, I, I'm more. You see, I, I drink water, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I drink coke. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's okay. Anyway, guys, uh, this is Roberto, and you've got to check his channel. It's, it's Roberto uh, V the World, and he, and it's funny. I don't watch many YouTubers, but I like this guy. He, he makes me laugh. He's funny. So um, you, you'll be at tomorrow's show, but this will be on Monday when this goes up. But well, anyway, guys, please check his channel. Roberto, thank you. Oh, also, and I'm pretty sure we're going to have some parties. Yeah, yeah, bro, for sure. <laughs> and, 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 and listen, guys, I like this dude. I am sober. I will like him more when I'm not sober. <laughs> yeah. Because sometimes you, know, you, you ask me questions now when I'm, when I'm sober. Yeah. You need to ask these questions when I'm drunk. Because okay. I, I have like eight different Roberto. You and know? let me just say, he has no, he, you know, I've, I sometimes make a video when I'm drunk and I don't show it, I cut it, because like, I feel a bit embarrassed. You don't, you don't no, care. No, of course not, bro. You don't care. Don't He's care. just saying like, right guys, I'm just gonna have to switch off the camera now because uh, I'm, I'm gonna go with this woman. Switch the camera, comes back sweating. Whew, that was good, bro. Yeah, but <laughs> if I obviously could film it, I will film it all, because for, for me it's like this. If I'm drinking, you know, drinking, obviously it's not so good for my body, then I film it all. Mm -hmm. Why should I throw away my body for nothing? Agree, That's a little bit of my motto, bro. But anyways, this like when I'm drunk, I'm a, a little bit different person, you know. So then you should ask me this question, you know, and then <laughs> maybe have better answers. <laughs> we'll do that soon. We'll do that soon. This is Devola Prawn Gratin, and my friend Roberto this has is had the lady boy pasta. Of <laughs> drunk, so I only eat this. <laughs> so, so let me have a taste of this. If you want to have a taste of yours and tell us the. Bro, lady boys are strong. <laughs> wow. Good, yeah? Mm. Hey, by the way, thanks for inviting me. Eh? Hey, you're welcome. Anytime. So, right, guys, I'm going to tuck in this now. This is, is this a croissant or something? Or cheese, something cheesy, anyway. But it's red hot. It's obviously come out of the oven. Let me have, let me have a taste. Let me have a taste. Ooh. Oh, yeah, that's good. Crack on, Dan. You have yours. Enjoy your meal, yeah. Thank you very much, Max. Thanks, That's it, guys. Right, Roberto, you enjoy that? Bro, really much. Thank you for the food, man. Oh, you're welcome. What do you, nah, think, of, what do you think of the food? I really like it, bro. This place is actually one of the best places. It's crazy. Because you know. Do you like pasta? Bro, I like pasta. Bro, Robin Hood is the one of the best places in Pattaya, honestly. On Google Review, it has yeah, like the yeah, best. Yeah, it does. I like it, bro. I just noticed something, bro. Yeah. What's this here? What? What's this here? What? <laughs> bro, I was in this Monkey Island, you know? In the what? Monkey Island. Oh, I thought you said Monkey. No, monkey. The oh, monkey okay, that okay. to be a bite me. Oh, it's a monkey. Oh, bro, okay, I'm, okay. I'm a boring YouTuber, like, bro. I, I don't like ladyboy, bro. I, I, I go home, man. I, bro, bye, man. Go, go in. I joke, I joke. <laughs> I, I like this guy, man. <laughs> Guys, thank you I much. want to see you drunk, man. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs>